Hey guys, my name is Hayden Cassidy and I'm an Andes Global Educator. We're here today at my studio in London in the UK. Today I'm going to show you some of my favourite techniques that have helped me to become a successful barber. I hope you enjoy them and let's create together. In this tutorial, we're going to create a soft and subtle buzz cut with a skin fade finish. We're going to take you through a step by step. Start by removing the bulk of the hair with your master cordless clipper and your number 4 attachment comb. Ensure you're using a comb to comb the hair and working from front to the back. It's important to make sure that the hair is evenly taken away. Next, use your number three attachment comb and start to work on the side of the head. Use a C-shaped motion as you reach the top of the head. Drop the lever and start to work just below that. It's important to use your clipper in all directions to work with the growth of the head. Next, soften the hairline by using your number two attachment comb. Use your Super Z or 2 detachable blade clipper to start creating your zero guideline. We want the fade to be nice and soft and subtle so we don't want to take the zero guideline too high. Remove the hair towards the back of the neck and ensure that your outlines are symmetrical. Use your Andes Slimline Pro Trimmer to take the hair down underneath your Super ZR detachable blade. Yeah. This will allow you to make way for your next step. Using your Andes Pro Foil Lithium Titanium Foil Shaver, start to take the hair down to bald. Notice I'm using the foil shaver with one foil head. This will prevent me creating any lines and allow me to create a smooth, smooth blend. Next, you use your US Pro Cordless Adjustable Blade Clipper to create your next step. I'm using a number one attachment comb, which will allow me to create my next guideline. Ensure your guidelines are easy to see so as you don't get lost in the fade. Now use your one and a half attachment comb, which will blend into the number two attachment comb you use with your master cordless. Ensure you're working against grow patterns to really remove the length and create a smooth finish. Buzz cuts can look the simplest, but are often the hardest to achieve a seamless look. Now use your zero attachment comb to refine the previous step. 
we're working with a mixture of ascending and descending fading techniques. This is the best technique I find when creating buzz cuts. It allows you to visually guide yourself throughout the haircut, creating a smooth, seamless look without creating too many lines. Ensure when we're fading, we're using the corner of our clipper and constantly adjusting the lever to the correct length. To remove the last guideline, we're going to use our US Pro Cordless Adjustable Play Clipper Fade Edition to start our precision fading. Using the corner, this will allow us to remove the line completely. We want the haircut to be nice and soft and subtle, so we're going to create our guidelines using our GTX XO, which will allow us to create a frame around the haircut, but ensure that it's nice and soft and no lines are pushed back. To soften the front of the haircut, I'm gonna use my GTX XO to shaft the hair and create a textured look around the hairline. This can create a nice soft finish. Use the GTX XO to clean off any excess hair and the Andis Copper Profile Lithium Titanium Foil Shaver to finish off the haircut. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you've enjoyed some of the techniques I've shared with you. Enjoy using them in your everyday salon or barbershop and I hope to see you soon.